Lately, Gemini has been my favorite model to use when writing content. It's very smart and intelligent and writes really in-depth SEO-optimized content. Now, Google has also released a new model of Gemini called Gemini 2.5 Pro, but this is the May 6th update. If we go into aistudio.google.com, this is where you can use the playground and play around with Gemini models. We can see here that Gemini 2.5, uh, there's two different models. Again, we have Flash Preview, which is April 17th, and then we have Pro Preview, which is uh, May 5th. I've selected that model and I've used it to write an article and this is the result in which I was able to get back. So first I primed the AI by telling it how to write in an SEO optimized format that is more engaging. These are for my low AI prompts. I will leave a link for uh, the Google Sheet if you'd like to use those prompts. And then I told it essentially how SEO writing is supposed to be. And then I told it to use that information above write an SEO optimized article on the topic, how to integrate AI into sales processes. And I want you to include these keywords naturally throughout the article. So I got these keywords from uh, New and Writer, which is a content optimization tool. And again, if you guys want to check out New and Writer, I'll leave a link for it. Sometimes there is lifetime deals, so you can just pay once for it and get access forever. But essentially, it's a content optimization tool that gives you benchmarks that you need to follow if you like to outrank some of the top competitors for that specific keyword. So I told it to include those keywords because then we can test it on Neuron Writer to see how it did in terms of following those instructions. So if we scroll down here, we can see that they actually went ahead and included some external links. They have some uh, list. So let's go ahead. We're going to copy over the markdown. We're going to convert this. And I want to take a look to see what the article looks like once it's converted. Okay, so this is the markdown. Supercharge your success. How to seamlessly integrate AI into your sales process. The business world is buzzing and AI is the dynamo powering much of that excitement. That number is the number of the terms that are used within the article. So I'd probably tell it to not include that because again, we told it to include X amount, amount of terms within the article. I think it's when I had to include those numbers within the actual article itself. So I don't really like that. I would definitely tell it to not do that again, but you know, this is a good starting point. Um, the article is decent in terms of length. It's not the longest by any means. Let's go ahead and do a quick test on New and Writer. So we're going to paste this in here. We're also going to generate our meta description. Save and close. This should give us a little bit of power. So we got 55 out of 100, which is not bad. But again, of course, I would like to have something a little bit longer. Now, there's a couple of different ways in which you can use Gemini for completely free. This is the first way. The second way is by actually using my tool, which is WordRocket. And we've included Gemini into the actual um, into the actual templates. So once you log into WordRocket, as you can see, there's a couple of different templates in which you can choose from. In order to use Gemini for completely free, there's two ways. You can use the all-in-one SEO generator or the free SEO block post generator. So if you wanted to use an all-in-one SEO generator, we can then enter in our sitemap. For this example, I'm going to leave it blank. Then we're going to paste in the keywords in which we're going after. We're going to use Gemini 2.5 Pro. Our key is already there. And then I'm going to copy over these keywords. And I'm, I'm going to tell us to use these keywords naturally throughout the article, right? So we're going to put this up to 2,000 words. Sure, let's write from the first person perspective, and then we're going to generate content. We will be updating WordRocket to have the best models of Gemini that are free to use, of course. Um, so you have to pay literally zero dollars. And as you can see, it took us a couple of seconds and we're able to get a pretty in-depth article. So let's go ahead and copy over the markdown. So we're going to remove this. And if there is some markdown issues, all you have to do is scroll all the way up, remove this little piece of code. And then we get the full article. So we get a nice article, key takeaways, nice pull quote there, tables, list. The article seems to be a little bit longer. So let's go ahead and copy this. We're going to head back over to New and Writer. We're going to paste in our new content. And as you can see, we got a score of 65 out of 100. It's 2,000 words. It's a little bit longer. We didn't do anything differently. All we did was took the same prompt with the same keywords, and we used our tool instead of using Gemini. And as you can see here, we're able to get a much longer output. And that is because we've pre-prompted our tool. We've included some really in-depth prompts for it to get the best possible outputs. So you can use Gemini within the aistudio.google.com, or you can use it in WordRocket for completely free. Whatever you like to use is up to you. Again, you have the ability to enter in your sitemap so you can actually get custom internal links with WordRocket.
So if you guys wanted to try it, Word Rocket, I'll leave a link for the tool in the description below today's video. Thank you guys for watching. I will see you in the next one. Take care.